Hello guys and welcome back to another campaign episode. First off, happy holidays to everyone. And uh wish you all the best for New Year's. Secondly, sorry for being a little bit off the last couple of days. I've been taking some uh, rest days after the 24 hour stream, so uh but yeah, we're done with that now, so we should be back on it. And yeah, we have the fourth Tariq Ibn Siyad mission coming up. Crossing the Pyrenees. Let's go. 732 AD, year 110 of the Hijira. After many years, our people have finally found another glorious leader to follow, seeking vengeance for the defeat of our armies at the hands of the Franks over 10 years before. Abd ar Rahman al Gafiki has rallied our armies for another campaign. Bred on the battlefield, al Gafiki is no stranger to the ways of war. Having waged war on the Visigoths, Asturians, and Franks, his most recent exploit was the quelling of a rebellion by the Berber governor in Catalonia. If we are to invade the land of the Franks, we must make a dangerous crossing of the Pyrenees. To arrive at the other side in time to start our campaign in the spring, we'll be forced to start this journey in the dead of winter. The rugged terrain is difficult for armies to cross, and ambushes will almost certainly be frequent. Many men will not survive the journey. I grow old, but I will make this journey through the frigid mountains so that I might see another year of conquest. All right. Cross no. The passes through the Pyrenees are treacherous and crawling with enemy troops. You have a long and trying journey ahead of you. Brace yourself for frigid winds and be wary of enemy ambushes. We must reach the Allied camp on the other side of the mountains before the cold of winter claims us all. Alright, first off, I know the game volume already is quite loud, low, loud. We'll turn on that a little bit. Secondly, we have a lot of units, 99 to be exact. Let's see, so... Yeah, our hero, 15 of your men, and at least one supply cart must reach the Umayyad camp north of the Pyrenees. Oh, is this a mission where we can't, where we're not gonna be able to make economy and stuff? So I can see on minimap here, we see on the top north. But we're supposed to reach apparently so we got to be careful i think navigating the terrain of the pyrenees is difficult get accustomed to tight mountain passes and adapt your strategy accordingly the enemy fortresses nestled in the mountains are nigh impregnable if you encounter one turning around and finding another route is the best course of action you have no way of researching upgrades but local villagers may be impressed by your army and supply with and supply you with the upgrades you need Protect your ranged units, their tactical value increases exponentially in this land of cliffs, paths, cliff paths and narrow passes. Throughout the most of the map, the high walls of the mountains will protect your troops from the worst of the elements. Cliff passes, however, are treacherous and exposed to the harsh winds. Units lingering in them for too long will begin to suffer damage due to exposure of the cold. Okay, so there's gonna be like areas where our units will like, I suppose they will lose health. Uh, so you gotta be careful with that. Uh, okay, the army of uh, our hero has assembled near a local village just south of the Pyrenees Mountains. Their objective is to cross the treacherous region and rendezvous with the Umayyad soldiers, who have made camp north of the mountain range. A few local villages dot the map, overlooking important junctions and the mountain passes. Their location makes them apt resting places, but seemingly little more. Three enemies pose a significant threat to the Umayyad armies as it crosses the Pyrenees. The Asturians are only a faint presence in this region, but their fortified bastion in the center of the map and well-trained heavily armored troops nevertheless pose a threat worth considering. The Visigoths prowl the eastern Pyrenees and are based in a fortress overlooking one of the major eastern passes. Their balanced army of infantry, range units and light cavalry will provide stout opposition to any who will pass their way. The Basques are native to the Western Pyrenees. Their army of light infantry, javelineers, and light cavalry would normally only pose a token threat, but their adept strategic juice of, of the terrain makes them deadly to even better equipped force. So if we're gonna go east or west here, I think we're gonna wanna go west because 
I don't want to fight the goth. I'm just trying to organize my units here. Uh, we have three trade cards. I'm not sure if they're of any use. Maybe they'll be of use to one of the local villages. Okay, so what do we do? What do we have here? Okay, we have a lot of ranged cavalry ranged units. Uh, Alright, let's do like this. Okay, we're gonna try and be careful with our range units naturally. And I'll try to use my infantry in front. Oh no! Um, not sure about this location for us here. Probably not the best, but I think I think it's actually it's pretty it should be decent. I'm gonna try and break out with these to go for his archers. I mean our helps are fighting cavalry, that's good. Yeah, I think that was a good fight for us. I actually lost some range units here. That I didn't want to lose. Okay. I feel like the cavalry archers are gonna be like our main oh god, I have no control over these units. The pathing is so awkward. Well, cavalry archers will be our main forces, I would say. Okay, that was a fairly easy cleanup. Ah, I'm not sure what <laughs> Yeah, it's okay. I don't feel like I have control over my Hotkeys either, control groups. I have no intent to go to that fortress, Saya, so don't you worry. Wait, did, did our hero have to survive? It doesn't say that he... Well, oh, it does. He has to reach, okay. So he has to survive, damn it. Okay, what I'm gonna do, I'm gonna send, like, send one of them to scout west. And then we'll uh, probably go this way, because I don't think I want to go up there. Uh, okay. Let's just turn around right away. Scout here. Uh, yeah, I think I prefer to fight... Fight green. Yeah, I think so. Definitely think so. Trying... Uh, 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 no. Well, that's, that's okay, actually. Just debate some units if possible. Right, I'm gonna put these guys on the hill. I think we'll use our uh, cavalry here. Should probably use my hero. Ah, uh, no, he doesn't have the best armor. Yeah. Okay, I want to be careful because you never know with these missions. Suddenly you go on a big bloop, a bloop, and suddenly you lost your whole army. Really cost efficiently. No, in inefficiently. And suddenly you're in a pickle. This this seems fine though. Yeah, seems fine. We'll just move along. Take that out. Is the tower even shooting? Oh, it is shooting. Okay, we'll send this wounded hussar forward. The scout. Yeah, okay, I feel like I should keep these trade cards alive. Let us traverse this pass quickly, lest the cold winds sap us of our strength. Okay, so here I assume we'll lose health if we stay too long. Or like, we'll lose health as, as we go. Yeah, as you can see, already lost HP. No, he had 10, right? Am I just... Oh yeah, now he has 8. Okay, so you lose 1 HP like every something seconds. In which case, I think... Okay, my plan here will just be to send the light cavalry and cav archers forward to kill, clean up this, so the other units can just run straight through without taking too much damage. I'm just gonna make them here so the pathing won't be too awkward. Here we go! Forward! Yeah, only one HP every, like, something second shouldn't be too bad. So I wanna, I don't wanna, like, have to stay behind my fast units with these guys, so I'm gonna let them clean up the pass. And once they've cleaned it up, I'll follow so these guys can just walk straight through. 
Go, go, go! I really don't want to fight those helps. Yeah, there we go. Should be better. Now we can fight. Yeah, maybe I over... Yeah, the pass doesn't seem that long. I could probably just run straight through. I'm gonna go now. Should we have cleaned it all up by the time we get there? Say that, then you see some more units. Oh. Yeah, I'm pretty sure I'll go to the left here. Or is that... Oh, look at this mountain. I've never seen a mountain like that before in age. Oh, God. There's more units than I thought there would be. Should still be okay, though. We'll go here. Hope for the best. Alright, let's just run straight through. Keep this guy just to... Oh, oh no. That should be okay. Keep this guy just to debate the tower fire. Uh, maybe there's a monk or something. Onwards! Maybe there is a monk or something we can run into here to heal our units. Would not surprise me if that's the case. Oh, I hear some locals. Sure thing, bro. Did I already get upgrades or do I have to go to... Well, we have... Do we have plus three? Did I already get upgrades or what? I feel like I'm not sure if we had plus T on these on these units before. He didn't ever get plus three though. Uh, does it say anything here? Well, I'm just gonna assume that we got upgrades then. We have plus four attack now. I'm not sure if we had that before. I should have checked that. Uh, is there a way to talk with anyone here? It doesn't seem a way. All right, we'll just continue on then. I wish we run into a monk or something soon. I can heal my units. Everyone is wounded now. Oh no. Mm. I did say our range gets exponentially stronger as the game goes on. So I should take care of those. Try to at least. And we have chemistry as well. I assume we got some upgrades there. Should have paid better attention. So it is all good. I mean, we're almost, we're halfway there pretty much. Actually, I'm not sure if we have to go like across here first and then to the left again. So I can't say we're halfway there, but it, based on the minimap, we are closing in. That much I can say. Alright. I think I want to use my infantry more as well, if possible. Get into your group. All right, what do we have here? Okay. The main road to the southeast is guarded by two enemy fortresses. We must take the mountain pass to the northeast. Bad timing to take a sip of my coffee. Wasted a hustler for nothing. Okay, I'm gonna put him on there so he takes the damage since he's a hero. He will heal. Okay, so what did it say? We have to. We must take the pass northeast. Okay. Roger that, sir. Use one Huster again to scout ahead. See what we can find. More infantry escorting. Infernal cliffside pass. Pray to Allah, it is the last. Uh, so another one. Is that infernal cliff? Okay, so it's another one we're gonna lose health. That's not good. <laughs> yeah, I'm just. I'm gonna send my cavalry in here as well because. There were infantry there helps and stuff. Well, not many, but... And they barely have upgrades. I guess it doesn't really make a difference. But I would like to keep as many units as alive as possible. As long as possible. Because... We're gonna lose... Why are you stuck there? Hello? That's just annoying. Come on, Camelacha. Well, whatever. Alright, we'll use the same strategy as before. We'll move in. Or we're gonna lose HP. Yeah, we're losing HP again. Uh, yeah, we'll just move in here. Ah, shit. <laughs> Walked into that mangonel, did I not? 
Uh, okay, onwards. We're running out of cavalry as meat shield, but we are very close to the path. We have a lot of units alive still, though, so I'm not worried yet. Another stuck unit. Oh, no, another one! Are you kidding me? Uh, maybe take out that as well. Thank you. Okay. That was a much shorter one. Well, rip these guys. They're stuck. There's needed 15 units plus... Uh, wait, do these guys regenerate health? What are not they? They're not taking damage. 15 units plus are... And at least one of the supply cards. Okay. Yeah, we have more than enough units, but they're all getting kind of low HP. Don't like that. We'll just hit them on a little bit. Okay, I'll send the infantry in first here. Oh, they are dying. Well, screw you, traitors. Go, go, go. Well, I feel... I mean, we're so close. We're just one screen away. They should have... Did we make it already, or...? I assume there might be a final fight of some sort. This is something we can just hit and run, though. I'm still gonna... I feel like we have enough units, so I'm just gonna send... Oh, no. I'm not liking this. I'm gonna... Uh, I hope we have enough. We should have enough. We have Imperial Edge upgrades on our cavalry as well. As well. Still 50 population. Yeah, we should be fine. Yeah. Alright. There's one thing I've learned is not take anything for granted when... Oh, no. Shit. <laughs> uh, where's our hero? Okay, he's, he's fine. Yeah, we should be fine. We don't have too many more units, though. We need, what, 15 units? Okay, I'm, 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 I'm scared, worried now. Oh no, got him, Huskarls. Oh god. I'm messing up. I'm failing. Oh no. Ah, uh, hope they don't have more units than this. Oh no. This is problematic. <gasps> God, he took a lot of damage to the Huskarl. I really hope this is the last they have. This is not the last they have, we are in Pickle. God, I'm saying Pickle too much now. I mean, these... I'm pretty much delete these, since we can't use these guys anyway. So we have effectively... We have 20 units now. <laughs> uh, I'm almost considering just making a run for it now, if in case there are more units, because we need 15 men. Our hero, 15 men, and at least one of the supply cards. I might just scout a little bit with Mr. Abdar Rahman here. Yeah, it seems like we're fine, so I might just make a run for it. If there are more units up here, then we are not fine. But I think we are fine. <gasps> no. Yeah, like, I could have been really sneaky here and just use my hero, heal him up and hit and run here. Um, let's see, what would be the best solution? There's not many units though, it should be only like those. So I think, since they don't have upgrades, it should be alright. I still managed to lose one unit. Yeah, I'm playing it overly careful now, but with good reason. Please don't tell me there's more now. They go on the hill. Everyone on the hill. Oh, these guys do some. A final busk ambush stands between us and our goal. Press forward and fight bravely. That was way more use than I was hoping for. Uh, final fight, and here we are. 
scared. I mean, how many? Oh god, no. Ah, they have a lot of units. I'm going for it. I think it should be okay like this. Right? Uh, don't mess up pathing right now, please. Should be alright. They do have throat rangers though, still. But we have these guys doing damage from afar. Oh, I don't want to run into the traps here. Oh no, there's scorpions as well. Run back to the. Those scorpions have ballistics almost. Okay, I'm going for it. Get him! Are you kidding me? Do I not have enough units now? Eight in population. Are you kidding me? Is this for real? I need 15 units plus the hero. I have 18 units right now. One of them, three of them are trade cards, which means that I have 15 units in total with the hero. If that means that I'm failing this mission, I swear to God, I'll be mad. Can the, I, I, I hope these guys count as an extra guy. Please, God. I mean, if that's not the case, then the glitching when they got stuck here and here is what killed us here. And that's gonna be super annoying. Oh, God. Please tell me it's enough. Please tell me it's enough. Please tell me it's enough. Please. Oh, it seems like it... <laughs> Rest and then continue our conquest. Oh, thank God. <laughs> if, I, if this would have counted as a loss, since I, I mean, I only have 14 men outside of uh, him when it comes to warriors, but since these guys count as men, I guess that saved us. So, I mean, yeah, not sure we can never push in here. That would just be madness. I wonder about taking the right side, though, right path. Wonder what would happen over here. Maybe just the same thing. Get blacksmith upgrades. Could be something else. Oh, this path seems way tougher though. I'm looking at the units they have. Yeah, I think going to the right would have been way harder. Maybe even... Maybe even... Yeah, it would be really tough actually. A really long path here with where you would have units hurt like all the way, it seems like from here to here almost. Here maybe, here to... Here. That's a long path. I think right side would have been really tough to pull off. So I'm happy with our choice. It was close though in the end. <laughs> Definitely was close. Yeah, let's uh, let's turn up the sound and listen to what Mr. This Mr. Guy says. Truly, I have not endured such a trying journey in the entirety of my life. The cold and cruel winds were like nothing I have ever experienced, and the fear of enemy ambushes lurking behind every bend is enough to drive a man mad. Between the elements and enemy blades, many of our men perished on the crossing. Nevertheless, we arrived in considerable force on the other side. It is more than many hoped for. We have little time to rest and recover our strength. The Franks will not lie waiting forever. Roger that. Let's quickly go through the stats. KDA ratio heavily in our favor, naturally. Alright, that was uh, Crossing the Pyrenees. Hope you guys enjoyed it. Coming up, I think, will be the last one. I could be wrong. But it's called Razia. Razia. Hopefully you guys are hyped for that. Thanks a lot for watching, everyone. And I will see you next time.